information. A half century ago, critics complained that Sesame Street was damaging our youth by perpetuating Madison Avenue's obsession with short attention span theater and sound bites. Now, social media and Twitter anxiety are the number one cause of decline in the skilled use of the English language. You speak, and for those over 20 or people so unhip it's a miracle your bum hasn't fallen off, that means youth speak is the reason we're living in a society where misunderstandings abound. People live and stay in their own custom-tailored bubble of misinformation. Anxiety and depression are at an all-time high. Happiness is at an all-time low. Motivation and effort are repressed. And everyone appears to be out only for themselves. But now is the time of the year we're supposed to put all that aside and try to remember each other. I say, let's do it. Not because it's Christmas, not because we think we have to, but because random acts of kindness, paying it forward and focusing on helping each other almost instantly does more to help ourselves. So let's do it without any expectation of a thank you, a return in kind, or even acknowledgement. You know, leave a donut on someone's desk in another part of the class, or even another classroom, and never let them know that moment of joy came from anyone in particular. Give a dollar to the guy on the street, and push out your biases to where it may be spent. Celebrate the season of Advent with four weeks of little graces, regardless of whether the big grace at the climax of the season is your goal or not. Let's see if we can't change the world, or at least brighten it up a bit, even if only for a few moments. Ugh. You guys suck! What is? This day in 1768, the first edition of the Encyclopedia Britannica was published. Okay, my questions about this in no particular order are, what does published mean? What's an encyclopedia? And why was there a second edition? Ugh! Boeing! Boeing! Ah! Ah! I'm dying! Ah! Oh, it's also Human Rights Day, Logger Day, and Lost and Found Day. And that's today's Does It Bear Digest. Tune in tomorrow for the Graham Norat Show. Oh, I like him.